It's a step toward expanding the Fort Wayne International Airport. Officials revealed the new name for a new private terminal this afternoon. 15 Finds Out first told you about the potential changes for private aircraft last summer. And Adam Widener continues our coverage now live from the airport with the latest. Behind me is the newly named Fort Wayne Aero Center. The $4.5 million project is scheduled to be completed in January and it hopes to add both jobs and experience for aviation lovers. FWA has taken off on a new service and it's called the Fort Wayne Aero Center. We wanted to make sure Fort Wayne was in the name. Airport officials have revealed the name of the new private terminal currently under construction. Leaders are moving it south from the previous terminal to make way for more gates at FWA, which leaders say is the next step for expansion. Atlantic Aviation is the current fixed base operator, or FBO. It's in charge of fuel and maintenance for all aircraft and has its own private terminal. In February, the airport authority decided not to use Atlantic anymore and will operate as its own FBO. Scott Hinderman with the airport says leaders hope Atlantic employees will work at the new facility. We have interviewed them uh, once already. We have a, another interview coming up uh, probably mid-summer or late summer. and we, we look forward to all those employees coming over and being uh, parts of Fort Wayne Aero Center. Hinderman says aircraft use the private terminal 35,000 times every year. He says investing in a new facility will make a positive impact in the area's image. As people come into Fort Wayne, we are going to be their front doors, the first thing they see after they land. And those who even operate and are from Fort Wayne, they come and go from the airport. It's going to be a really attractive facility with a lot of amenities for uh, the aviation user. The new FBO is funded with public dollars, but Henderman says it will be open to the public. The front lobby area will have a large glass wall where anyone can come and watch planes take off and land here at FWA. We're live at the Fort Wayne International Airport. Adam Widener, News Channel 15.